Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce you to the first, and in my opinion, the most interesting German helicopter in the whole tech tree. The first one you get. I know that sounds bad, but in my opinion, it really is the one that can do the most things. This is the SA-31B Alouette. Oh, that sounds familiar. Uh, Alouette. Dunta dunta Alouette Zette Plumore Zette Plumore Le Bec Zette Plumore Le Bec A Le Bec A Le Bec Ah I don't know if that's really it but sorry I just got really good PTSD for when my mother used to sing me lullabies she she spoke French by the way very very interesting fact but many thanks to Opinion Outpost for supporting the channel and bringing you guys today's video. What Opinion Outposts is, is a place for you to earn War Thunder Golden Eagles cash and gift cards by completing surveys to help companies better their products. Check out that link in the description below to start earning your GE now. Many thanks to Opinion Outposts for supporting and sponsoring this video. A true skin and bone helicopter. I mean, look, there's, there's, this is just a, a skeleton for a tail. The engine that powers this thing is from a, a school project. 50 kilograms of thrust. 50 kilograms of thrust. Now, at the same time, you're really not lifting much, but still. Here's the cockpit. Here's the fuel. Here's the engine. Here's the transmission. And uh, there's the tail rotor. And that's all I need to know, at least for how the chopper is. But I assume you have seen some cooler things on this chopper. We have four SS11 ATGMs, really respectable, 500 millimeters of pen. But the highlight for me is being able to use Hitler buzzsaws on a chopper. It just blows my mind that, I mean, this, this gun is still in service. This World War II looking gun is still in service. Now, this isn't an MG42. This is an MG3, which is a MG42 that's been recalibered to NATO 7.62 by 51. Hopefully that's 100% correct. If not... Let me know in the comments below. But yeah, we have four of these, a hundred, or excuse me, a thousand rounds of ammunition. So probably enough ammunition to fire for about maybe 11 or 12 seconds. And then there's this other weird weapon system we have on here. Why War Thunder? Why even model this? Why even give this to us? I mean, this would be great if we had like, if choppers had to take out Oh, I mean, this would be great for a helicopter RB and AB, you know, take out soft targets, etc. But in tank RB, these things really don't do anything. Maybe if you get an open top ZSU or a M19 or something like that, then these things will do actually a lot of damage. But these only these things only have 0 0.02 kilograms of explosive mass. Two millimeters of pen at any angle at any range. Luckily, though, at least on the dev server, you don't have to grind for the SS-11 missiles. Next chopper, though, is the UH-1D, which is a stretch version, I just guess, for more troops or for more or evacuating more uh, troops that are, have been injured. Pretty cool chopper. You get a lot of um, things to use, Hydras, MGs, and then the um, six SS-11s, or at least, yeah, SS-11s. And then that's kind of where... The German choppers stop being interesting. I really don't like seeing this though, personally. MI24P, very good chopper, very good armament, very good modifications or customization the chopper has. But we'll go on to the BO-105. Now this one actually, yeah, this is going to be the chopper that the Red Bull stunt guy uses. Very sick looking chopper, but that's that's it. All you have are the hot missiles. You have six, so you have no way to defend yourself, and you only have six shots, which is you know balanced. But is it enjoyable? I don't know. I think all I would do is just grab this one. This this is the most interesting one there is, and you keep going down, and uh, you might get more pen for these ATGMs, but you still have six. The premium version has eight. I wonder why. Hmm? 
Eight toes. These can do what? 800 millimeters? 630. Okay, these will be the toe ones. Now, okay, this is the dev server. Things can easily be changed. But I shit you not, these were the last modification I was expecting on a German helicopter. So with that said, I, I, what, I don't really know too much about German helicopters, but there has to be other modifications that, that you can put on. Nope. Don't pop that smoke! Through the fire and flames. Okay, so we have. <laughs> that was probably the coolest way to go out I had in a uh, Leopard 2A4 right there. Here we are. Wonderful. I, I absolutely love this chopper. Oh, God, she's quiet. She's pretty nimble as well. Okay, let's get moving. 80 kilometers an hour. Let's go with a full dive here. Oh, if you guys haven't seen SS-11 um, helicopter ATGMs in action, you're going to love it. Got some AIs. I want to get a real, a real tanker. I'm sorry about that. Let's go and drop altitude. Yeah, I, I really wish it would, would... Vortex wing, ring, wing, blah, blah. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Be, please be friendly. Please be friendly. Yeah, friends. Friends. I love them. Gosh, I really wish this thing could build above uh, the uh, alert menu for uh, the low main rotor RPM reduced collective. Maybe we'll just fly at like 73 collective. Okay, we got a fire right here. On the way. Look how slow it moves. Uh oh, is it dead? Yeah, it's dead. Okay, can we find anyone else? I mean, it's so slow moving, right? We can just, like, do anything with it. Oh, it didn't track that far. Okay, we got um some AIs. I don't really want to go after AIs, though, but it's so late in the dev server, there's not too many players playing. Ooh, ooh. thought there was a chopper. C? We're like right above it. Where is C? Okay, here we are. Orbital strike. Nice. Let's go. Let's go get it. My cap. My cap. Is there anyone else over here? Hopefully not. Okay, let's lower that collective. Oh, Jesus. Hang on. We got to dodge these. I don't know what they are. We're at 130. Hey, God. Oh, I, I guys, I, I, I uh, damaged my engine. Okay, here we go. We got to do a. Uh, <laughs> this thing. No, nope, we're just completely toast. Okay. Well, guys, that was the Alouette. Very, very effective. Golly, can can you just can can we just have a little bit of grace here on the dev server? Just just make it a little bit less. Yep, the school project engine definitely uh, failed with our high RPMs. All we need to do is get another killer too, and we'll have the uh, the Bow 105. We got the uh, little bit of uh, SP needed to spawn in it. Oh my god, do all the German choppers do this? This uh, low main rotor RPM reduced collective? If so, they're going to get a different alert for it, or at least just tone it down for the Germans. Beautiful looking chopper. Now, okay, this is an aerobatic chopper. No, not the same one, but it's the same model. That makes sense. Yeah, totally aerob 
Totally arrow back. Look at that. Wow, it's actually really responsive though. Can you get enemy call it over here? Tow missile. Oh, it's an object. Can you please go up here so I can eradicate you? We got a BTR on the way. This thing has to hold break, right? Oh, thank gosh. Where's the object? Is he still burning? No, 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 no. I, I, I think he's done with that. Oh, shit. BMP2, actually. Okay, there goes that uh, hot. We gotta find out where that BMP2 is. Oh, I see him, I see him, I see him. Slower down. Oh, damn it. Fellas, hope you have enjoyed this dev server video. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to bring some more entertaining gameplay. Just It's just the nature of the dev server. But overall, yeah. Not really... Uh, I don't know. I just thought that uh, the German shoppers would have a little bit more customization and stuff. But still, this is the dev server. A little disappointing. I gotta say, that's my overall feeling right now with the German shoppers. But guys, again, I hope you have enjoyed. Have a great one. Peace out.